Hello friends, today we are reviewing the M1 Max Spray Airless Paint Sprayer and I am excited. <laughs> Let's go ahead and unbox it. User manual. Oh my god. Here is our 25 feet of hose. Our laminated quick instructions. This is so exciting! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so excited! So, so exciting! So, so exciting! So, so exciting! You will also receive brushes and wrenches to help you put it together as well as maintain it and keep it clean as well as a 12 inch extension tip. Now let's listen to my friend who's been painting for over 20 years. Right on the heel that you push before you prime it. Let me tell you, it was an easy setup. Is this not music to your ears? You just put it like on low spray. Okay. And don't forget you got to flip this button back up like that okay and then you can cut it on we tightened up the sprayer and then we were ready to go so he started me with water because he didn't believe someone could learn how to do this in just an hour but as you can see i got that thing right away this is something that i think you can do as well it was simple it was easy and we are now ready for paint. Once we added the real paint, he had to show me, he just needed to be sure that I could really do this. But once he saw how easy it was to pick it up, then he allowed me to do all the work after, as I've already said. But one thing I did want to note is he loved the 360 movement of the spray nozzle. It was easy to move around. Your cord didn't get all tangled up. And that was one thing that he noted. As a 20 year painter, he was very excited about that feature. And as you can see, I am doing the thing. And not only that, this 25 foot hose allowed me to be able to move around to all of the doors that we were painting. It was very convenient. And like I said, just in love with the process and love with the M1 sprayer. Full transparency, this was a paid promotion, but I have to tell y'all, if y'all know me, I am not going to promote something I do not love. And I thoroughly enjoyed this day in learning how to use this M1 airless paint sprayer. So if you don't have one and it's something you're looking at, try this one out. Now that we've gotten that out of the way, let's talk about the cleanup. It promotes that it is an easy 10 minute cleanup. And I must tell you guys, it was. The process was easy. Um, you know, my professional is still trying to show me all the things, but I think he's trying to figure it out. He wanted to know how much it cost so that he could look at the machine himself. But the process of cleaning, painting, all of it was just an easy, simple process and something, again, that I think that we all can do and we can be painting up some stuff. So you can see here he's using the brushes to get it all clean. He didn't want me to get my hands dirty, even though I had paint all over him. So, like I said, if you're interested, the M1 Max Airless Paint Sprayer is the bomb.com so go check it out in the links below and i'll see you all the next time